Hi, I'm Tony. Welcome to Sports Bike Shop's video about how to remove and refit the visor on a Kberg Avalon helmet. So, Kberg Avalon helmet is a pretty simple visor mechanism once you know how to do it. So, let me show you, and hopefully, you'll have the knack by the time you've watched this video. So, we start by pulling the visor all the way open, and then it needs to go back one notch until this tab just in front of the ring here sits in the open section of the channel that you'll see around here that it runs in. Then what we do is we just grip the visor here and pull it forward until the front front tab, the one just here, is dislocated and sits on top of that runner like that. So then it's really simple case of just operating this lever tab just here and that visor should ping clear. Really simple. So repeat on the other side. Just make sure that this tab is in the open section of the channel. Pull forward until that tab is dislocated and sits on top there. Operate the tab and away comes the visor. So to refit the visor, as ever, just the reverse of what we did before, but there's a bit more to it than that. So the first job is we're going to get this tab here located again into the open section of that channel in which it runs. So that's that bit just here. We also want to get the tang on the back of this mounting ring into this section just here. So first of all, locate those two, that's fine. And then we apply some pressure on the back there while pulling the visor forward until this tab locates back over just like that. So that's now in place, it's on its runner. Repeat on the other side. So that tang into the back there, this into the open section of the channel, apply that pressure, pull forward and that's reseated. Just operate it a couple of times just to check that's seated and that's fine. So onto the sun visor, a bit tricky with this helmet. Normal advice with sun visors from me would be don't remove it unless you have to because if you're taking it out to clean it, it's probably going to get covered in fingerprints while you do it. So you're going to have to clean it again afterwards anyway, defeating the whole object. With this helmet, it's particularly fiddly. So really don't take this out unless you absolutely have to. But if you do have to, this is how you do it. So lower it. First thing with this helmet, make sure it's fully lowered. There's a, some, it can be a bit annoying that you need to push it just a bit harder to get it fully lowered. Then just get hold of the visor, lower it as much as you can. There's not much room in here. That's what make this, makes this tricky. And then just pull until that comes clear. Then try and get that free because it'll make it a bit easier on the other side as well. So pull that clear and then repeat on the other side. We've got a bit more maneuverability now. Get hold, pull, and then the visor's clear. In terms of refitting it, those two sections, these two lugs here, go into a runner that you can see just between the shell and the EPS. So we're gonna feed those down into there as best we can. Click. Turn the helmet again, look for these two tangs, maybe come in underneath the helmet, gives you a bit more room, feed that down into its channel, push till we hear a click. Click. Operate a couple of times just to make sure that we've got free movement on that sun visor, which it looks like we have. The whole thing's operating as it should do, so that's how you remove and refit the visor on a Kberg Avalon helmet. Thanks for watching. 